Hi guys. <laughs> well, we were supposed to deliver this to him. As, oh, we'll do it from the side. We'll do it from the side so we're not okay. blocking the Thank traffic. You. Thank you. Uh, we're here today with the interfaith community and with OWS folks to continue our campaign and asking Trinity for space at Sixton Canal, moving into the Christmas holiday season and looking ahead to the coming months, it feels really imperative that a space where we can come together is found. The ask is right now, so you're not saying no to the wrong thing, is can we have a conversation with some of these organizers about procuring outside space in lower Manhattan for the Occupy Wall Street movement? Can you come to the table and be in our ally in that work? Let's start calling people. Let's start talking to people. You have more well, we friends think, than we have. I think what I'm saying, Michael, is, is that we're really clear that the no is, is it is a no to the private property right. at 6th Avenue and, and Canal. To have a conversation about public space. No, no, I'm, I'm saying about, but, but, uh, let me be but, clear but, too. But, but I'll be equally as clear. Okay. I hear what you're saying. Private space is one of those things that I think we need to revision mm -hmm. in all of this. Mm -hmm. Charity is not going to cut it. Charity keeps the poor poor, the rich yeah. rich, and this is the difference between charity and justice. We give thanks for the work of Occupy Wall Street, for the light that occurs in every part of the world because of the voices they've raised. We ask for your call for discernment as we continue to look for ways we can work together. We work together even though in some cases we disagree. So we know that we are all your children in this movement as part of your call. In your name we pray. Amen. Amen. I guess what I'm trying to frame it is, is who we are and where we start this. And we so, start in the same place. I love your prayer. We're, we're together on the on this. So, so, but it, so, but so, it's, it's the problem is when it gets down into the real world. We're asking for a chance to have a different kind of conversation in this city. The gift of the nativity scene to me is a reminder of where we came from. Our whole tradition was about someone coming and not having space, not having room. And in the outskirts, in the wilderness, in the in-between places, in the empty lots, in the manger, that's where God enters the world. When it's darkest, when it's coldest, when the nights are longest, when we're huddling outside, we have to remember all those who don't have the privilege to go home to a warm fire. There's a spiritual revival element to this where we ask ourselves, do our traditions deal with and confront the real world, real life vectors of class and money and race and power, the things that really affect how our lives in space function? Is it, are we doing that still? If we are, that's great. But if we're not, what are we?